Hey there guys, Rashid Ivan here. Welcome to another gym review. Today we are outside Energy Fitness in Croydon. East Croydon Station Energy Fitness. Let's go inside, see what they're saying. Let's do this. Energy Fitness, East Croydon. Now, I was quite surprised when I walked into this gym. It's not what you'd expect from when you're looking on the outside, but when you walk in, the lighting's really nice, the equipment's really new, the layout is good also. It's not the biggest gym, but for the size and locality where it is, I think it's a really good gym. It's based in East Croydon, so its transportation links are fantastic. There's no parking, which is a bit of a shame. Croydon, as some of you might know, is a nightmare to park around anyway and extremely expensive. But for those that are living locally and just getting transportation to and from the gym, I think it's a great gym. Staff there are really friendly. What I also really like about this gym is when you turn the corner you've got all these boxing bags lined up. I think that's so cool. It is inspiring. So if you've never punched a bag before, ask one of the members of staff. Find out how to do it effectively and efficiently. You don't want to hurt your wrists. The studio is a decent size and the spin studio is a decent size. Hey guys, we're joined with Sam here at Energy Fitness in East Croydon. How are you Sam? I'm good, how are you? Yeah, I'm not too bad, thanks. Good. So Sam is a personal trainer here at East Croydon Energy Fitness. So do you want to tell the guys a bit about yourself Sam? How you got in the industry and yeah, whatever else. Yeah, so my name's Sam, obviously you said already. Um, I'm an IFBB Pro Bodybuilder. So I got my British Championship in 2007. Okay, wow. And then they gave me a pro card and I was competing overseas and team COVID here, so I can't be competing now. Um, so basically how I got into PT is, is that I had my daughter, I got first little depression and the doctor said why don't you try some fitness classes and I went to Zumba. Zumba, I don't know why I did that. I don't like really, really like Zumba, but I started that. Um, and then I started doing weights to see my body change. And then my partner then entered into a body Okay. Fast forward seven years later, the Cambridge champion. But I started life and have a bit of changing. Yeah. And I want to help other people. And that's when I trained to be a personal trainer. Okay. Brilliant. So I've been a personal trainer for like three, four years now. Okay. And I love it because it's like what you It's all about you. Yeah. You're like that competing. Yeah. It's all about me. It's all about me all, all the time. All the time. And literally, I realised that I focus so much on myself. I'm not gonna lie. I didn't focus on my clients enough. So when I pulled back from my body, like egotistical bodybuilding, yeah, yeah, I then realised I can help a whole lot of people. And now I've got a front load of clients. Uh, I, do, I do it online and obviously in person. And I just thought that I've now found my purpose in the fitness industry, which is to help others. Oh, okay, brilliant. So it started from you had your child, yeah. and once you were trying to lose the baby weight. I got personal yeah. depression, yeah. because I really like this. Right. And then through that, through fitness, Help me get my um, depression down, and now I'm constantly probably enough depression free. So. Hey. Exactly, good, exactly. Definitely, fitness helps with the mental health. Yes. Releasing those um, endorphins yeah. to help you feel positive and incorporating it in a great way so you end up looking as great as Sam. Yeah, well, no, but I'm off season, so I look a bit. <laughs> yeah, but right, yeah, like that. Yeah. <laughs> like that. So, man, do you want to give them your socials? Tell them where they can find yes. you. Yes, you can find me on Instagram at like fitnessfanatic2016. I also do an outdoor classes with a live DJ three times a week. Wow. And it's called Lockdown Bootcamp. Um, it was created in lockdown. And literally we have three classes a week, we go outside and we basically do boxing and hit classes. And also some band work for the booty and the legs. Um, three times a week in Clapham. 
and also I do an online coach, I do, I'm an online coach, so I'll do online coaching as well. Brilliant. And um, also, sorry, Facebook, just, just Google Sam Forbes, you'll see me, trust me. Okay, well, we're going to add all the socials down there at the bottom. If you are feeling Samantha, feel free to add her, check her out. And boom, at Machine Ivan PT at riptraining.com. We're joined here with Monica at Energy Fitness Croydon. So, Monica is a duty manager here at Energy Fitness. So, um, yeah, how did you get into the industry? What would you say your likes are, dislikes about the gym and everything you've experienced so far? Right. So, um, I really like working that place. Um, I can meet a lot of people. Actually, we're selling, we're selling something fantastic. That we're selling better life. You can feel better, yes. It's something that doesn't have any value because it's the most important. Your health is the most important, important thing. So, that's, that makes me very proud to work in this place wow. because every, every day I can, I can sell that thing to people. You can catch Monica here at Energy Fitness Croydon. Overall, I'm going to give Energy Fitness Croydon a four star. The reason why it's not five is just because of the parking as well as the changing rooms. The changing rooms could have been a bit cleaner. They could be, you know, just that bit better. But aside from that, it's going to be a four star. Again, prices and promotions are susceptible to change. So I'm going to put Energy Fitness Gym's website link at the bottom of this video. Don't forget to hit that bell, like and subscribe to be notified for other gym updates like Energy Fitness Croydon.